Muhammad Ali utilized the speedball a great deal in his training and everybody would like to be able to use one effectively and to look good at it. And we're going to show you how to do that in just a couple of minutes. We can guarantee you'll be able to do this too in just a few minutes. Let's show you how. Okay, like everything, we have to do this in a few steps. Now it's very difficult to use a speedball. So what we're going to do is firstly let the air out of the ball very slightly. This is going to make the ball move slower. Most often the ball moves too quickly for people, so let the air out of it a little bit so you can squeeze the ball as well. Okay guys, the other thing you should do if you're a beginner is perhaps use a ball more like this. This ball is a lot longer than the one I'm going to demonstrate with and the longer the ball, the slower it will move and it's much easier for you to use. Let the air out and use a bigger ball. This ball is called a peanut ball and moves a lot faster so it's not ideal for a beginner. But we can still do our demonstration on this because the principles still apply. Okay, the first thing we do is we get ourselves into our boxing stance and line ourselves up with the speed ball. Ideally the ball should be somewhere around about the level of your chin, roughly. And what you're going to do then is you've got to remember to keep your hands high, but you're going to hit it first with open hands, like this. It's much easier to control the ball this way when you're pushing it forward rather than punching it forward. Because we have to learn the rhythm first before we can close our hands. So with this, what we're going to do is we're going to push the ball forward and try to keep the ball going straight. And what we do is we keep our hands high. If you drop your hands, you've got further to recover your hands up. And when this ball starts moving faster, it's going to be much harder for you to hit. So we start here and maybe get a friend to hold their hand under here so you can't drop your hand too far. And what we'll do is do this. We have to start and get the rhythm. Keeping the hands high, like this. And what we're going to do is we keep our hands high and we get that rhythm of one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, punching on the one. So, we'll do that again. It's very simple. Now, if the ball starts to stray and goes off in different directions, it's very difficult to recover the ball to central, so what you should do is stop the ball and start again. What you're trying to do is to hit dead in the center of the ball. If you hit to the side, the ball's going to go to different sides. Once you've mastered this, what you can do then is you can close your hands and start to hit it with your fists. Now some people hit like this, but this is an incorrect punching technique. It's okay to do that when you've been practicing with the thing for a while, but really we should be striking with the knuckles like this. So we try and get that rhythm, one, two, three, one, two, three. Now because this is a slightly different range to this, you'll need to move back a couple of inches to do this. So from here, one, two, three, one, two, three. Keeping your hands high all the time. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter if you hit two times with this hand, two times with this hand, or one, one, one. Makes no difference. Just practice to start with one, one, one. That's the easiest way to start. Then you can double up on different hands. Here we go, once again. Do not hit the ball too hard. Take your time with it. The, fa the harder you hit it, the faster the ball goes. And it becomes much harder to get your hands in the right place. Eventually, when you do this, you'll be able to do this with your eyes closed because you'll just hear the rhythm. Let's try that. But if you're hitting the ball in the right place, you can use just one finger to keep the ball going. So as long as you hit the ball in the right place, it will work. So we've got three steps. Firstly there, secondly there, and then we can start to speed the ball up. So we can start to hit the thing a bit faster. Good luck with it guys. I hope you enjoy it as much as I enjoy it and as much as Ali enjoyed it. <laughs>